The School of Commoning is a commons-based social enterprise established in London under UK law as a community interest company in May 2011. Our mission is to enhance individual and collective competencies in the creation, protection and governance of commons of all types. The international monetary system and the gambling away of our increasingly privatised resources appear to be at the heart of what we must change. We must create a commons-based monetary system. Can we really wait for the 1%, the few in power, to do this for us? As globally renowned commons theorist and activist James Quilligan said at the Occupy Wall Street conference, Making Worlds, the world's financial system, which is in crisis, won't be solved until we have a new international monetary system. We won't have an international monetary system until we solve the ecological and energy crisis. And we won't solve the ecological and energy crisis until we have low carbon production and trade. And we won't get to the point of low carbon production and trade until we redefine the boundaries of resource domains. If we are going to transform the economy and government into component parts of the biosphere, we have to redefine the boundaries of resource domains. That means occupy the commons. James Bernard Quilligan. So let's occupy the commons and let's reinvent boundaries so that they work for people by co-creating new social institutions in all domains. I.e. in the Occupy movements, general assemblies could be the early seeds of a political commons. And let's build common in cultures. As we occupy and develop these social institutions and cultural practices, to assist in stewarding our resource domains, we must also form alliances with commons-friendly market and state actors who see the long-term advantages that supporting the commons will give. One particular commons theorist, activist and policy analyst who has worked extensively as an advisor to governments, businesses, civil society, media and educators is James Quilligan. As you will see in the following timeline of School of Commoning activities, May 2012 will see James Quilligan arrive in London to give a series of 12 interrelated seminars on the emergence of a commons-based economy, the first seminar taking place in the House of Commons. The School of Commoning is here to co-learn and co-create a commons-based culture and society from and by the grassroots. Our past events have all taken place in London and included a talk and informal discussion with Michelle Bounds, founder of the Peer to Peer Foundation, a workshop event in June discussing the democratic mobilisations that emerged in Greece and Spain, a presentation to Niger Delta delegates and a seminar by James Quilligan. This month we continued our Remarkable Commoners series which has already seen Michelle Bounds and James Quilligan come to London and we welcomed Leo Burke this month to our school. These events have been rich with learning insights from commoners at the very leading edge of the international commons movement. We've also just begun the Commoning Cafe in a weekly format, which will gift us the time and space for informal networking and introductory learning about the commons for people new to the commons and a chance for more experienced commoners to connect on a weekly basis. Most of our energies, however, have been devoted to the Future of Occupy project, which aims to provide a mirror to the movement's awakening collective intelligence about its future. Initiated by co-founder of the School of Commoning, George Poor, and other members of the school, it now has a Future of Occupy team that spans from Europe to North and South America. You can learn more about this project and join the conversation there at www.thefutureofoccupy.org. Looking ahead to the future events of the School of Commoning, we will be convening an incubation event on the Urban Space Commons in late April for architects and designers interested in commons-based approaches to designing our spaces. Then in May, we have a very exciting social innovation project held over 12 consecutive days, which will see renowned commons economist James Quilligan arrive in London to give 12 interrelated seminars on the commons. The Quilligan seminars supporting the emergence of a commons-based economy will be held May 7th to May 18th. Each event will be hosted by our convening partners that include the Finance Innovation Lab, the School of Economic Science and the New Economics Foundation. 
We'll also be hosting online courses on the Commons and leading up to the Quilligan seminars, we're working to promote the introductory e-course to the Global Commons run through the United Nations Institute for Training and Research. For more information on these upcoming events and to donate towards all the work we are doing in the lead up to the Quilligan seminars, please go to our website www.schoolofcommoning.com. And if you are an occupier or a supporter of the movement, we greatly welcome donations in support of our team's totally voluntary and unfunded efforts at the www.thefutureofoccupy.org.